Hi, I'm Jeremy Stamis with Review.com. We're at the Samsung booth at Photokina, and we're going to talk about the Samsung Galaxy Camera with a built-in uh, Android operating system. And uh, what is it, 3G or is it? Wh the what's 3G, 4G, and Wi-Fi. All right. So there'll be a, a 3G, 4G connected version. There'll also be a Wi-Fi version as well. Okay. So the Galaxy Camera marries uh, kind of our top-of-the-line compact camera architecture with 21x zoom, backside illuminated CMOS for low light with uh, uh, full functions and power of, a, of essentially a Galaxy S3 phone. Right. So uh, quad core processor, all that great stuff. It gives uh, users the ability to, to use their cameras as a camera, but customize it fully like they do with every other smart device right. they've got. Um, download apps from the App Store, uh, uh, share, edit, you know, right after shooting, just like just like they, they want to do. Right, and you can even use apps that aren't really necessarily camera related as well. Like, could you download? I mean, can you check your email on the phone? Things oh, sure. like that. It's got a full browser on it. Um, while it, it won't work as a as a normal phone, you could load Skype on it and use Skype. Uh, Interesting. For for alternate phone applications, right? Which is pretty cool. And what Android operating system is loaded? It's on? running Jelly Bean. Okay. Um, as well on the on the camera itself, there's a there's a headphone mic jack on it. Uh, battery in the bottom, micro USB port for charging, so like every other smart device out there, charging connected. There's another micro USB port on the bottom, so if you wanted to power it or, or someone came up with an extra power accessory, they could attach that to it. It uses a micro SD slot. There's also a slot for a SIM card in there as well right. for 3G, 4G versions. Okay. Um, you'll notice that the, uh, the back of the camera is... Uh, Oh wait, this one is locked down. You note that, notice that the back of the camera is a, um, a huge 4.8 inch right. uh, capacitive touchscreen, just just like a smartphone. All your camera functions are there. Uh, uh, you can run full manual controls to this interface as well. It's pretty cool. There's also a, a pop-up flash on it, so that's something a smartphone wouldn't have in terms of driving uh, for better image quality. All right, great. That sounds good. Uh, for more information about the Samsung Galaxy camera or any cameras, head over to review.com.